Hi Oakington, uh, it's me again. Unfortunately, yesterday I did have to take down my my post mainly because the the information that I was sharing was uh, wasn't clarifying exactly what was going to happen. So I apologise for any confusion that was caused yesterday. But actually, the 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 guidelines that have been sent out by DMAT um, last night um, clarify a, a little bit closer to what what I was saying. But that is absolutely. Uh, fine. So watch out this, for this space. Watch your emails because the school is contacting people. They are trying to keep people updated as much as they are updated. So um, if anyone uh, needs any help or support, just let us know and I can help. Um, well, remember, we, we are a church and we're here to support the school. We're not here talking on behalf of the school. Um, so when I say stuff, it's not it's not because the school's asked me to say it at all. It's because I'm wanting to share the information and trying to help those who have a bit of uh, uncertainty at the moment. And um, the Clarge Jojo's um, packs will be sent and, and people will be able to do homework with their children uh, and spend some time with them. And it's important that we do so. Now, I know that there's been a lot of uncertainty uh, recently. There's the, obviously people that are self-employed, those who, um, who, are, who are vulnerable and own themselves are trying their best to um, organize the um, food for people that desperately need it um, but we're also doing a food bank so remember um, if you have extra food uh, or you stockpiled and you want to share with the community that'll be absolutely great there's going to be um, a food box in the church um, when I'm working and there's gonna in the mornings and there's a food box at the um, the shop as well so please drop in some food if you can if um, it will help the those around us who are vulnerable and those who are on low incomes um, the government also released that they were pausing uh, mortgages for people so that they didn't have to worry about the financial pressure of having to pay the mortgage they also released social um, housing information so go to the website, have a look. Um, my understanding is that they will not evict anyone for not, not being able to pay their bill, but they're also helping, they will help in some way in terms of uh, a benefit system going forward uh, is my understanding. I could not, I could be wrong. <laughs> um, I, I tend to be sometimes. Um, but just make sure that you know you're not panicking over these uh, things now if any of you are in debt now my understanding is if you ring your bank and say can you pause the interest you should be able to um, at the same time you must deal with with these problems but at the, you know if you need any help I'm here I'm here at the church like I said and other people around you are also here to help so just remember there is a lot of uh, support in this village for everyone not just the few so um what else there is um information on um online about a lot of the other things that the government are releasing but to, to be fair they've made the announcement and they're going to send all that information through different ways eventually so if you are self-employed don't worry about what's going to happen i believe that they're going to try and protect you just as much as those who who get paid by wages and stuff like that so watch this space. Uh, like I said, we're here as a church. Let's uh, uplift the government in prayer. Make sure that they're doing everything they, they possibly can. Uh, in, in, and by praying for them, it means we're supporting what they're doing uh, as well. So let's just pray. Lord, let's just pray for the government. Give them wisdom. Give them the, the peace of mind to be able to run this country effectively. We know that Brexit is still around the corner as well. And Lord, we just pray that they use their knowledge and wisdom to be able to move forward as quickly as possible and protect those around us who are vulnerable and those who need um, support. In Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys, like I said, I'm here. My details will come out at the end again. If you want any help, let me know. Um, we're here to support as a church. The church is ready to help as much as we can. Of course, self-isolation makes it a bit harder, but you, we can have a distance prayer. Just come down and, and we can talk about whatever you need to talk about if you need to talk. Does that make sense? I hope it does. May God bless you and stay safe. Goodbye.